price we've ever offered on a true three in one. This is from our cool living brand, which is all about being the specialist when it comes to air conditioning. We love this brand and this is a true three in one. What does that mean? It's an AC, it's a portable air conditioner, but it's also a fan and get this, it's also a dehumidifier. This is actually going to replace three different appliances in your home. And today it's going to be nearly $100 off our regular price. We have flex pay for you as well. We always have interest-free monthly payment plans here at HSN and we also have those 30 day returns. But let's talk about what the experts have already been talking about. They are predicting one of the hottest summers on record. And guess what we're gonna be doing? We're gonna be staying at home this summer, and if you wanna stay home and stay cool, uh, check out what some of these temperatures are already being recorded. In fact, it's not even technically summer, it's just the first week of June, uh, but if you're in Savannah or New Orleans or Sacramento, Little Rock, Las Vegas, 95, already over 100 degrees in Arizona. It has been hot and humid here in Florida, so we are ready to keep you cool, and this is the ticket to do it. In fact, I'm gonna turn it on right now, and you will feel, if you're standing right next to it, the, a big blast of Arctic air. In fact, this is going to keep you so cool, not just sitting next to it, but in a 500 square foot room. It's gonna give you everything you need, including not only the wonderful wheels, so it's portable, you can slide it from room to room. You are getting the window unit. You're also going to get this fancy little remote control, so you can control it from wherever you are. But it is so powerful. So if you want to keep cool this summer, this is the ticket. They have been very, very popular. We just introduced this on clearance a couple hours ago and hundreds and hundreds of you have been shopping. So enjoy this. We're going to go right to our expert, Carrie McNally, uh, who looks about as cold as I feel right now. <laughs> Carrie, did you notice I waited till the very last possible moment to turn this on? Because as you know, our oh. studios are already super cold, but good to see you, my friend. Good to see you, sir. Hey guys, how are you? And uh, it's right, when you've turned this on, it's a blast of Arctic air. Having spent some time in a uh, supermarket as a kid, as a checkout guy and a, a stock boy in a supermarket, walking into one of those, you know, those huge refrigerators, you freeze immediately in the Marine Corps. I worked in the chow hall for a little while, a walk-in freezer, you get hit with it. And that's what this is all about. It's the ultimate three-in-one because it's a fan. It's also an evaporative dehumidifier, which means it's gonna take all the moisture right out of the air, and it's a world-class AC that works immediately. It is Arctic air right out of the box. All you're gonna do is find the spot where you wanna leave your cool living, portable AC, and just chill out for the summer. We call ours R2, lovingly. We've got two boys here in the house, a 14-year-old and a nine-year-old, and the nine-year-old Spencer, so that's R2. We're gonna name that R2. And it is so simple and easy to set up. You don't have to hire anyone. You don't have to have a stranger come into your home. I'm gonna walk you through it right now. So you're going to get the attachment pieces. These are gonna be in the box. It couldn't be easier. This is, looks like, and this is the same thing as an exhaust fan for your dryer, right? It sort of reminds me of that. Remember that show, Sarah? Um, Lost in Space, Danger, Will Robinson. Danger, <laughs> Will Robinson. So all you do is you put the little plastic thing, you screw it right onto the end of the exhaust tube. Then you screw the exhaust tube into the section that's going to go outside. Then all you're going to do is simply rest this in the windowsill, and then you're going to open it up to customize exactly your window. Now, if you have a traditional window that goes up and down, you're good to go, just like the one that we have there at the studios on HSN. Here in our house at the McNally home, Kara and Carrie, we've got a left to righter. So this thing goes from right, right to left. We wanted to put it on the other side, we could go right to left, left, right. But it goes all the way to the top, which gives you another option, which I think is phenomenal. Hey, Bernie. It's my, it's my uh, neighbor, Bernie, and his dog, Jack. Um, it gives you the opportunity to do this with a sliding glass door. How awesome is that? Now, when we talk about something that gets cold, the proof is in the pudding, right? This is what's called an infrared thermometer. Wolfgang Puck, Curtis Stone, chefs use these to check the temperature, the outside temperature of food. So we're gonna go ahead and get you a temperature reading here of the outside of the unit, which is right around 66 degrees, right? Which is comfortable, right? 66. Now I'm going to point the infrared laser into the unit and watch what happens, 38, 39, 37, 35. 
34, 33, 32, freezing. And it keeps going down and down, almost like somebody running the football into the end zone. That's why you're able to, with a unit this size, to chill, I mean, really make it cold in a room the size of 500 square feet plus. Now, I want to give you an idea of the space that we have. This is our downstairs here, and we're in Florida, not far from the studios. This is an 11-foot ceiling, 25 feet this way and 50 feet that way. And we can cool this entire space with our cool living portable air conditioner. That's how powerful it is. You get the remote. It couldn't be any easier to operate. You can do everything you need to do from the remote. It comes with a 24-hour timer. So if you want to set it to turn on like an hour before you go to bed or shut off an hour after you get out of bed or an hour before you get out of bed, you're in complete control. So easy. The fifth letter and the 26th letter of the alphabet, my favorite letters, E-Z. And um, then you've got an instruction manual that's simple and easy to read without your reading glasses, which I really appreciate. And it's going to last you for years and years. And one of the things that we do in this house is we do zone cooling. So if we're going to spend a lot of time down here, we're going to go upstairs where the thermostat is. We're going to take that up to like 75, 78, 79, 80 degrees. We're going to fire up R2, and it's going to be 71 degrees down here. Now, my gorgeous and brilliant wife, Kara, she likes to sleep cold. She wants it around 69 degrees, 68 degrees in the bedroom, right? That's why I wear a Parker to bed, and I pull the hood over my head. But, <laughs> so we bring R2 lives upstairs in our bedroom. We've got it down here for demonstration purposes, but the rest of the house at 75, 77, it's 69 <laughs> degrees in our bedroom, and that makes my wife really happy. And check this distance out here. This is a balloon that we, we got her for Mother's Day. This thing's 10, 15 feet away, and it's blowing like it's in a breeze of about 15 to 20 knots. <laughs> That's how powerful this is. Yeah, it's the so other part powerful. Of it too is the, yeah, that's it. Oh, uh, okay, well, hang in there. I, I, I'm actually gonna show you my goosebumps on my arm because <laughs> it's actually so cold in here. Uh, my fingers are about to turn blue, but here's what I would love for you to consider today. If you would like to replace three different appliances in your home. Uh, it's not only going to replace those ugly window AC units, you know, the ones that like block out all the natural light and then you've got foam or cardboard or all kinds of little mismatched accessories to try to keep the air out and the bugs out. This is so much more affordable for you today. It also replaces those ugly portable fans, maybe the ones that you've been wheeling around or you try to put those big box fans and aim them at you from one side of the room to the other. It's also replacing those expensive dehumidifiers. So if you have a dehumidifier that needs replacing, don't spend this amount on a dehumidifier. We can actually get a three in one. It's your AC, it's your fan, it's your dehumidifier. If you love this idea and you've been waiting for something like this to come on clearance, uh, this is not something we usually do early in the summer. This is something we usually put on clearance at the end of the hot summer season. So. I I don't know that I've ever seen anything quite like this here at HSN at such an affordable price. So we did take nearly $100 off. We offer interest-free flexible payments if you want to put that on your major credit card of choice, your PayPal. But if you are planning on staying home this summer, and I know a lot of us have had to cancel a lot of our vacations, our road trips, if you're gonna be spending more time at home, uh, look for the price of what you'd spend at an, a night away or a couple nights in a hotel room. You will have a unit that, yes, it is a small investment, a considered purchase up front, I do understand that. This is gonna be something that you will use year after year, season after season, whether it's upstairs or downstairs, whether it's in the moldy and musty basement and you've got it running as a dehumidifier, or like Carrie suggested, you need some zone cooling where you are, whether it's your favorite living area or whether it's the bedroom. Uh, Carrie, I don't know about you, but it always feels like uh, wherever I live, there's always, whether it's an older house where I was in in Minnesota sure. or whether it was uh, a department in New York City, it never is quite the right temperature. And a lot of times there's nothing you can do about it depending on if it's an older construction or maybe it's just not an efficient AC unit or you're spending a lot of money trying to crank up the AC just to stay cool. This makes sure that you're cool in whatever room you're spending time in. 
Yeah, I was talking with my brother-in-law of 40 years today. He owns an air conditioning refrigeration company here in Fort Myers, Florida, not down, too far down the road. And he said, the reason older houses have those hot spots is very simple. They have a vent coming into the room with cold air, but they have no exhaust vent, right? And that's why this is so critical, the exhaust. So a gallon of cold air in means you've got to take a gallon of hot air out. And that's how you lower the humidity and the temperature really quickly because those older construction houses, they don't have that exhaust vent. So if you add this, now you can take that temperature way down. And if you do zone cooling, you can take the thermostat, push it up to 80, cool the room that you spend most of your time in, like down to 72, and you're gonna save a ton of money over the course of the summer and then next year and the year after and so on. Because this really will cool a space up to 500 square feet and more. And we are in a huge space down here. This room is 25 by 50 and it has an 11 foot ceiling. This is our whole downstairs area. This is where we eat, that's where I cook all the time. And that's where we watch HSN or a movie at night. I wanna walk you through the dashboard. It couldn't be easier to operate than the way they've laid it out at Cool Living. Here's your power button. Whenever you do need to empty uh, the water, it's not a lot of water, it'll let you know. This is turbo. You press this on when you come home and if it's really hot, just like when you get into the car after just sitting in the parking lot for a couple of hours. Medium, high, or low, it's even on low right now and it's freezing in here. Obviously self-explanatory temperature uh, gauge there, manual. And then here are your three settings, the snowflake, air conditioning. The fan is the fan, and this is your evaporative dehumidifier. As you mentioned before, and it's so important, this is three in one. So if you're a hobbyist and you spend some time in your garage and it's 100 degrees in there, it's probably because of a preponderance of moisture. Fire up this unit in the garage and in about 15 minutes, it'll be 72 degrees. It'll eliminate all of that moisture. Same thing down in the damp, dusty, you know, moist basement. The evaporative mm -hmm. dehumidifier gets that moisture out of the air without creating a giant bucket of water that you have to empty every single hour. And I wanna walk you really quickly back through the assembly. You'll get the unit, it's right out of the box. It's crisp, cool air like that. Before you plug it in, all you're gonna do is you're gonna take the exhaust tube, you're gonna put this plastic thing on, all you do is screw it in like a light bulb. Then you screw the actual exhaust tube into this part that's gonna go in the window right, just like screwing in a light bulb. Now this is gonna rest right in the windowsill. And when you close the window, it'll close to exactly the width of your window. Now, if you're like us here at the McNally Ranch, we've got a left to right window. But take a look, it goes all the way to the top. And this temperature right here is amazing how warm this is. This means you can do left to right or up or down or sliding glass doors as well. And then you plug it in, and you turn it on, and in just a matter of minutes, you're gonna have that crisp, cool, luxurious <laughs> air that you so richly deserve. Whether it's That's a necessity right. or a luxury item, this thing gets the job done big time. <laughs> and as you were mentioning, you know, one of my best friends in broadcasting has a master's in meteorology. He said, Carrie, I've done the math for you. This is gonna be the hottest summer ever since we've been keeping track of records. So it's a wow. great investment and it's a great gift for a loved one out there. Uh, I don't know if you can hear my teeth chattering, <laughs> but it is so <laughs> cold in here. Uh, but that's, that's exactly what you want, right? So uh, maybe yeah. it's not for you, maybe it's for a loved one. Are you thinking of a mom, a dad, a grandparent, uh, someone who lives alone, someone who tends to try to save money because they don't want to crank up the AC? Maybe you want to make sure that they're very comfortable because if you're not comfortable, you're probably you're probably not sleeping well. You're probably a little cranky around the house. You're probably not as efficient at getting work done or whether it's managing the household or managing your business. This can really make your life a whole lot easier. So let me give you a couple great ways to place your order. You can give us a call. Uh, we take your orders over the phone. We also can place your order online at hsn.com. That's a great way to get right to the front of the line and skip the queue. And then you can decide if you want to pay for it all up front. You want to pay for it in monthly installments. We've also reduced the shipping and handling, so you're saving a little extra there. But right now, this is the first day we've ever had this on clearance. We took nearly $100 off, and we have a limited quantity that we have available for sale because once this is gone, 
this is gone. In fact, uh, I just got an update. This is about half gone. It's supposed to last uh, through the midnight airing tonight. So if you want it, I would encourage you to reserve one. We'll get it out to you right away. You'll be enjoying it all summer long. Already more than 1,300 have been spoken for. So right now we have one for you. Uh, but I did hear some news earlier. Carrie, you mentioned this to me that right now there's actually a nationwide shortage of yep. AC units. Why is that? Well, it's just because everything got shut down, right? So everything is three months behind schedule. So imagine tens of thousands, if not hundreds of thousands of AC units being available for retailers around the country. They're not available. So Cool Living is phone is ringing off the hook. Can you get me some AC skin? This is it. This was a purchase that HSN made last year. So these goods are here. But imagine that a lot of stores won't have air conditioners maybe until the end of August. The other thing I think is really cool is that we're a couple of days into hurricane season. And if you're a family that has a home generator in case you lose power, this is another addition to that emergency kit, if you will. And I was again talking with my brother who owns an AC company. And he said, when you fire up that generator, you have a limited amount of power and fuel. Don't turn the air conditioner on. Don't turn that $10,000 home air conditioner on. Use mm -hmm. this and stay in a certain area and ride out that time until the power comes back on. Now, I want to walk you right back through how you're, you're mm -hmm. going to set it up. We were able to do it in less than five minutes. Here's, here are the pieces that are going to come in the box. The unit doesn't require any assembly at all. All we're gonna do is we're gonna put on the exhaust fan. So it's always important, a gallon of cold air in, a gallon of cold air out. It's really important to have an exhaust fan to have a, a functioning AC. So this little plastic piece is gonna sc screw right onto the actual exhaust hose, right? See that, that's flexible. I guess I could play a squeeze box if I owned one. Um, then that exhaust is gonna screw right into the windowsill bracket, right? Which is gonna sit in the windowsill. That's gonna go down to the AC. Then you're gonna be able to open this and or close it so it's a custom install. Then you're just gonna go ahead and tighten up the butterfly screws. We have a, an atypical window set up and that ours goes from left to right. But we set it up so it goes all the way to the top. We also include an additional little security bracket. So even though you have this in your window, you can still lock your window and still set it up for the alarm to go off if you need to. So they've thought of everything at Cool Living. I'm really honored and proud to be able to present this on HSN. I've been at this for over 20 years. And once again, I wanna show you the size of this room that we're in. This is our downstairs. This is where we eat, that's where I cook and Kara cooks, and that's where we watch TV over there, whether it's HSN or a, or a movie. This is a 50 by 25 foot room, and we're able to keep this nice and cool with just this unit. Now it's rated for 500 square feet, but when you do zone cooling, we're talking about a lot of money back in your pocketbook or in your purse, because if you want it to be 68 or 69, you want it really nice and cold when you sleep, have this in your bedroom. Turn the AC up to 75, 77, mm -hmm. 80. It'll still be 69 in your bedroom. And if that's what you want, that's what you deserve. My gorgeous and brilliant wife, she wants it at 69, <laughs> 68, 69 degrees when she sleeps, right? So we don't do that for the rest of this house. We leave yeah. the thermometer at 77, mm -hmm. and, but it's 69 degrees right. in our bedroom because happy wife. Happy life. You know and this what? is an awesome this is an awesome value. <laughs> yes. And and you know what? She got such a great night's sleep in that cool bedroom. She's doing a great job on the camera work, by the way. Uh, so uh, kudos to your wife doing an awesome job there. But think about it. Why are you cooling the whole house if for eight hours out of your 24-hour day you're only in one room? Maybe it's just your bedroom. Maybe you have an older house, or maybe you live in one of the northern states where you don't need a full AC unit in your home. Maybe you don't have one. Maybe you're in an apartment. Maybe you're in a <laughs> rental. Maybe you're in a condo. Maybe you're in an RV or you need something that you can take with you wherever you live, wherever you go. This is another great solution for you. Uh, maybe you have an AC unit that's not very efficient or you feel like all you do is waste time trying to cool off that top floor of your home. Meanwhile, the basement's freezing, right? So this can really help you turn down 
how you crank up the AC and it can help you save money in the long run. That's why making one investment today is such a great idea because you're, you're replacing three different other bulky types of appliances. You're replacing another window AC unit and gosh, those are kind of scary to install. <laughs> They're like, I used to try to install one on my fourth floor walk up in New York City and it would be tipping over the sidewalk below and then you've got to balance it and you, you got to worry about security, you got to worry about bugs getting in and air getting in and insulation all around it and it's just a big eyesore. And those wall AC or window AC units really block the view. I don't want you to block the view, especially if that's all you have and you're staying at home a little bit more often this summer. So think about replacing that wall AC. It replaces those big ugly fans. It replaces a dehumidifier. The other thing I love, I've had a dehumidifier for years in my basement in Minnesota. It would get very musty down there. And that dehumidifier was always working like overtime. I had to empty that bucket probably at least once a day. And if I didn't, the bucket would fill up and the unit would turn off and then it wasn't working because the bucket was full. You don't have any buckets to empty. It doesn't have to be near a drain. You don't have any messy water. You don't have the drips. You don't have the spills. All you need to be is within, let's see about what, eight feet of a window, six to seven feet of a window and you plug it in and you're good to go. Now, if you're just using it for the fan, it doesn't necessarily have to be in the window, uh, but for the AC unit and the dehumidifier, yes, you need that exhaust going. But I love that it's the easiest dehumidifier you ever need. Also, what I love is that there is no filter to replace. So there's no ongoing cost. It's a it's sort of a one-stop shop. Once you own it, you love it, you're enjoying it, there's no filter to replace. It's really easy to use and anyone can install it. Today it is on clearance, so if you're even considering it, I would love for you to place your order. That way we can get it to you, you can see for yourself and you can really enjoy a cool, cool, comfortable summer, because you're right. Uh, Carrie mentioned it, you deserve it. Uh, we've all been through a lot. We're all trying to get through uh, the next few months and see what they bring. But if you are gonna be staying at home more, this is a wonderful investment to make. And only today, can I guarantee, Right now, we have the quantities. However, it is now officially over half gone. So a lot of you placing your order online at hsn.com. Uh, now more than 1,400 have been spoken for. Uh, I think we only have about 1,000 left. And when they're gone, we will not be able to get this back into stock due to some of those uh, manufacturing slowdown shutdowns. And today, we've got the FlexPay for you as well. So you're saving nearly $100 off. It's a great brand. And I just, I love that you can really be in control, Carrie. You you can customize whether you want it in the kitchen, whether you want it in the bedroom, whether you want it in the living area, upstairs, downstairs. Sometimes you need an AC unit, sometimes you dehumidifier, and sometimes you need a fan. It's kind of like your one-stop shop. Absolutely, and you've got it all right there. The control is yours in the palm of your hand. And there's always someone that we love that's just hot all the time, right? It just, our body chemistry is different. And so my dad is part of the greatest generation. He's 94. He's just hot all the time. He's like, why is it so hot in here? And so he's 94. We, we make sure he's nice and cool when he comes and visits with us. And when we talk about how cool is it, how cool is it? So this is what's called an infrared thermometer. Curtis and uh, Wolfgang use these to take the temperature of food. So I just take the temperature with the infrared thermometer of the outside of the unit. It's 62 degrees. And then if I start aiming it at where the air is coming out, watch what happens. It's gonna start plummeting down to 34, 33. Now we're at freezing, this is freezing. 30 degrees, down in there to 29, 28. And with temperatures in places like Austin, Texas, over 100 degrees now, and we're in hurricane season when you may have a, a generator, this is a great thing to have in addition to that. Earlier when we were live on the air, it started to pour here in Florida. And it was obvious, it was sort of like, hey, does this thing work in the rain? Yeah, it works fine. The beauty of it is this is where all the hot air is going out. So you don't have to worry about, it's completely, it, it's all good. So that's the beauty of it. And this is all sealed in here. No bugs are coming in here. I, they give you an ex extra security bra bracket so that when this is in, this is still, this window is still locked, whether it goes up or down. And you can also do this with a sliding glass door. 
So it's an awesome opportunity. If you do give it, it's a wonderful gift. It sounds cliche, but it, it keeps on giving. You'll get emails and you'll get when you're FaceTiming with mom or dad and they'll go, I, like, I got a space heater for my dad last year and he just was so happy with it. His cat and he would just sit in his big chair in the middle of February and they would read a book. And once again, to install it, this comes in the box. You don't have to do anything in the machine. That hooks up to the back of the machine. You screw it into the right, it clicks into place. Then you take the exhaust tube, right? And screw it like a light bulb into this piece. This is the windowsill bracket. This sits in the windowsill, and then you just open it up to where you need it to be, and then you lock it in place, and you're good to go. Then you turn it on, and that's it. It couldn't be easier. The instruction manual is so simple and easy to read, and you don't necessarily need your reading glasses, which I appreciate. And then you also have a remote that works from about the others. I can go all the other side of this room and shut this okay. off. So you don't have to get out of bed. You don't have to get out of your favorite chair. It's all ready to go. Crisp, cool air right out of the box. Carrie, will you talk about all the, the modes and all the functions again for anybody who's sure. just tuning in and they're saying, wait a minute, Come on in. how are they doing a clearance AC unit right now at the beginning of summer? But it's really easy yeah. to use uh, with or without the remote. Right, so here is your dashboard. Very simple and easy. There's your power button. It has a small reservoir on it, but it takes a long time to fill up. If you need to fill it, there's just a little opening in the back. You put a little bowl on the floor. Here's your turbo cool. I like this. You fire this thing up, it goes automatically to 61 degrees, and it gets cold. I'm gonna apologize to my wife who's holding the camera right now. Obviously, here are your three speeds for the fan, and you're up and down with that. Now, here's your snowflake. That's your AC. There's just fan, and there's just evaporative dehumidification. And that takes all the moisture out of the air. But of course, AC is doing that at the same time. This is a really neat feature. And it's not hard to do this. You can set this. Let's say, say you kept this in your bedroom and you wanted it nice and cool like an hour before you go to sleep. You set, if, you go to, if you're in bed at nine o'clock, set it for eight, set it for 8.30. You know, you'll play with it. You'll figure it out. You get into bed and it's just where you want it to be. Then you get out of bed, get into the, get into the shower. It automatically shuts off again. So it's so super economical and so energy efficient. And if you do zone heat, this is a huge space down here. We could keep this right at 70 degrees the way it is right now and keep the rest of the house mm -hmm. at 80 and save a ton of money. Because I the second that. that home air conditioner fires up, right, they're $10,000 a piece. Mm -hmm. The second that thing turns on, it's money. That's right. all there is to it. <laughs> right. And that's the other reason it's a gift that keeps on giving, because these are tough times that we're getting through together. Yeah. And it's a great way to save money, but you don't have to sacrifice mm -hmm. because a lot of us are already making enough sacrifices and we're going to be home are. a lot more. And we're on top of each other. We've got the 14 year old, <laughs> the nine year old here. They were homeschooling. And the last thing you want to be <laughs> is really hot and sweating. <laughs> Carrie, thank so enjoy you it. so much. Uh, that's a great presentation. A we really appreciate it. But I'm, I'm with Carrie. Like, not only are we all on top of each other, we're stuck at home a little bit more than we'd like. And also, we can never agree as a family on what temperature the house or the apartment or the condo should actually be. So you can actually...